wonderful, wonderful, magical. It's that time when everybody smiles, eyes are shining bright. I still remember how I used to feel. Look at us now, walking around in the snow. Christmas way Soon there will be Sleigh bells and Santa Claus It's the number My friend Val for lunch. I haven't seen Val in the longest time. You guys will know who she is. Actually, she was in an empties and favorites video with Morn and I this past summer, and I haven't seen her since, so I can't wait to see her. We're gonna have a nice little lunch today, and then I've got a lot of errands to run. And then Mark and I have the um, the client kind of Christmas party we're gonna go to tonight. And uh, then we're probably gonna do something maybe after because it is Thirsty Thursday. So let me show you my outfit today. Honestly, guys, it's sort of kind of old. Um, the shirt, actually, the shirt I got right here. I don't remember where did I get this last year. I don't remember. Anyway, this little sweater jacket I have on with like the uh, velvet is, um, believe it or not, this is so old, you guys, but I love it. From Member of the Store Cache. This is one of those pieces that I've had that I love and it I don't, will ever go out of style. I love the zipper um, here on the um, on the sleeve. So it's super cute. I got a pair of my American Eagle jeans on and my, I forget what brand booties these are, but these are from Nordstrom. And, and oh, did I show you guys? I'm gonna let you on a little secret. Mark gave me one of my Christmas presents early and he just couldn't wait. He was so excited. So, um, Okay, well these earrings here of course are the two orchids boutique earrings which we are getting some back in so stay tuned. But I have a second piercing which I have not literally had an earring in there probably 10, 11 years. But every once in a while when I go to put my earrings in my normal, ear, you know, hole, area, hole there, it would slide into that second one. I kept telling myself that's really weird that that still was open. I have not had anything in that hole, those two second piercings, like I said, over 10 years. So Mark got me for our Christmas. You guys can see these gorgeous diamond studs, but what's inside in the middle is an emerald. And when he, I opened it, I'm like an emerald? It's Giada's first stone. I literally cried. I could not believe it. They are so beautiful. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to see if this second piercing, if, you know, the hole still fits an earring and they slid right in. So now I can wear these with uh, my bigger earrings. So it's like, almost like I got my second piercing all over again. Didn't even realize that it worked. That, but uh, I'll take it because now I can wear both. I'm real excited. I know, little things, little things in life that just excite me. I know. Um, okay guys, I'm going to straighten up a little bit, take Archie out and head out the door and meet Val for lunch. I'll make sure she says hi to you guys. All right guys, we're here at Cafe Capri on this gorgeous, well actually it's a chilly, but a very sunny day. There's my girl Val. We're going to enjoy some lunch. I'll show you what we're going to eat when we get inside. All right guys, we had a fun lunch. We didn't even show what we were eating because we were just having too much fun chatty. Merry Christmas everyone. Oh, and we're going to have her back in another video after the first of the year. Maybe doing like some kind of wintry fun accessories. What do you think? Oh, I think that would be so much fun. Alright guys. Oh, that's okay. okay. Thank you though. <laughs> Guys, I had such a nice lunch with Val. She is such a beautiful person inside and out. We had a lot of laughs, a lot of fun, and it was just great catching up with her. And uh, so I know she had some things she wanted to get done today, and I have a few errands I'm gonna run to. Actually, I'm gonna run into Alta 
I need to get um, Lauren's daughter turns 21 on Saturday so I want to get her an Ulta gift card because I know she's like her mama she loves makeup I'm gonna get her a gift card and I'm actually running really low on my blush and I need some so I'm gonna try to find something that's similar in the shade um, as far as blush so I'm going to uh, see if I can find something there and I'm not sure what else so uh, I don't know we'll just see uh, I have a few things on my list but a couple things I'm just not in the mood to do right now so we'll see hopefully I can find a nice blush I'm sure I can how can I not guys now off to Carter so I'm gonna find some little little stocking stuffery things from my little Giada well, I did have success and I got a really pretty uh, trio of a clinic uh, blush so I'll show you guys when I get home I was just at Carter's buying my little Giada she needs like little um, leggings and uh, cause she's growing out of her so I just went and bought a bunch and um, they have something going on right now at our local Carter's um, for like different price points you can purchase a pair of pajamas fleece jammies uh, to give to the children right now that are in um, your local hospital right now it's Akron Children's so I um, did purchase some jammies that goes right to the hospital which is just a few miles away from here so um, hey it's the least you could do for those poor children that are gonna be spending the holidays in the hospital and um, some cozy fleece jammies um, so yeah you know talking about that you know this year Every year we always do like a gift exchange Christmas Eve with the family. We always pick a name and we pick a dollar amount. Well, this year we all decided um, all of us are giving all of our money into a local family. And we're really excited about that. I mean, none of us need a, need the gifts, you know. And why not put our money towards uh, a family in need that we can give back this holiday season. And I'm really excited about it. Uh, we decided that on Thanksgiving that that's what we were going to do. And Aunt Missy was looking into it. And she was gonna find the family for us so um, I'm real excited about that and um, I, to me it just feels good to be able to help others out it really does and I love that Carter's is doing something as far as giving jammies to um, a child in the hospital for Christmas so um, anyway that was my little public service announcement I guess uh, well okay um, what am I gonna do now it is so cold out here I was gonna go buy stuff to make the quiz chickies tomorrow because my mom and I are gonna make them but I get my nails done tomorrow early so I'm thinking maybe I'll just go tomorrow and get what we need and uh, at the meantime I think I'm just gonna go home and get all cozy make myself a white a nice warm coffee and uh, we'll go our event calendars and then um, get ready to do our little event tonight Alrighty, guys we didn't do advent calendars today. Let's do uh, Christopher's and the one I have out there. Did we? No, we didn't. That's right. Okay. Hold on, Arch. I have little sesame sticks I was munching on. And Archie wants them. Okay, so today is 19th. is May 2 to 3. Inspiring and motivational post on social media. Hmm. A good one. I'm not quite sure what I would do. To think about that one. Because I'm blogging so much, I'm sort of getting social media out a little bit, if you guys can understand. <laughs> I think I try to be inspirational as it is on these vlog misses. Um, you know, I'm hoping that can count as, um, as kind of a, uh, act of kindness I'm hoping all right this one says donate a tray oh a toy for toys for tots for kids I think like I shared earlier today that all of us instead of giving Christmas gifts to one another yeah like we do a Christmas gift exchange Christmas Eve that we're doing that one the fam the one family so it's gonna be I'm sure it's gonna be a lot more than toys I'm not sure exactly what is everything that they need uh, I know Missy, like I said, was working on all that. Um, but that is a great program, though. Toys for Tots as well really is. Okay, so now... Alrighty, so let's go get these ones over with. So that way, if, you know, we're ready to head out, I'll have the advent calendars done for today. All right, the body shop. Okay, so today is 19. All right, here we go. There's 19. Ooh, white musk. 
Oh my gosh, I love anything musky. Let's go to Scentsy. This, is, this will be seven for us for Scentsy. Another little scent pod here. And this is Huckleberry Wreath. Oh, I don't know if I have... I'm not sure if I have that one. Oh, these guys, this whole this whole thing just smells so good. For the QVC Beauty Advent Calendar. I forgot to tell you guys. Did I tell you or not the perfume that I got that one day? It was Tova and actually smells really good. I'm not sure what this is. Let me get this out first. Okay, this is, it's hard, it's not focusing, but this is some kind of age-defying treatment. I'm not sure of this brand. But um, I'm going to read more about it. But there's like a bottle in here. Um, so anything to do with skincare, I love. So I'll check this one out. Alrighty, so now I'm just getting cozy here at the blankie. Um, just waiting to find out what time we're going to go later. Uh, I'm tired, guys. I've been sleeping like a solid rock. No, Arch, you cannot have a sesame stick. But yet... Yesterday and today, I, I literally am wiped out come like middle of the afternoon. Maybe I just need to drink a ton of water, too. Or maybe I just need to take a little siesta for a few minutes. <laughs> Look at him. He wants sesame sticks. You're being so bad. <laughs> All right, I'm going to finish watching The Housewives of Jersey. So I did not finish that yesterday. Have a few sesame sticks. Cuddle with Archie. And then uh, see what's going to happen here uh, for later tonight. Alrighty, so um, Mark's going to be coming home soon. He has his staff um, like little get together um, today. So it's running probably a little bit behind. So because of that, we probably won't be going to the client thing because we end up being late. We don't want to walk in late. And excuse me. So we may end up just doing something with friends here in a little bit. Um, but so I thought while I'm sitting here before he comes home, I would answer some questions. Uh, for you guys so let me get my phone here uh, let me see one of you asked me what are my plans have I shared them yet for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day I think I did but I'm not sure so Christmas Eve um, let's see what we do the kids will all be here and then we're gonna go to my mother-in-law's and we always have a nice uh, lunch we have smelts and we have um, a wedding soup and all kinds of yummy food and then we all get home like we'll come back here get ready then we all go to um, we all go to mass and uh, and then we go over to Aunt Missy's and have some appetizers and then we have the seven fishes uh, for dinner and uh, some of the kids, like nieces and nephews, like some of the kids are all going to be going different directions from that point. I know Morgan and Tony and Giada will be heading back to Pittsburgh right after Mass, right before dinner at Missy's because then Christmas morning, okay, so let me back up. So Christmas Eve is at Aunt Missy's. Some of the kids will be going their own way. Christmas morning, uh, we'll go over my mother-in-law's, have breakfast early, open some gifts there, and then um, we'll... Some of us will be heading to Pittsburgh to Morgan's. Morgan and Tony's and Giada's for Christmas. I'm so excited. Normally every year we have Christmas dinner here, but because they have their new house and the new baby, um, we're all going to go there for Christmas. So it's going to be so fun. I am beyond excited about that. Very excited though. My little baby girl, um, I just took her to the doctors and Giada has um, bronchitis. So sad. So anyway, I'm glad they took her and, you know, getting that taken care of. So hopefully by next week, she'll be feeling like so much better. Um, but what we do do is, um, like when Mark and I come home Christmas Eve from Aunt Missy's, it's like around like 11-ish, 11.30. Um, any of the kids that are around that night of our kids will open up their gifts then. And then at midnight, Mark and I love to watch um, Mass with the Pope. We love it. That's our tradition every year. We put it on and we almost like fall asleep to it. Um, but So that is our plans for Christmas Eve and Christmas. And of course you guys know um, we are having our Christmas Eve party here at the house. New Year's Eve party here at the house. I hired the pianist. Actually I just texted all of our friends and said hey if you guys can give me like each of you give me five songs that you would like the pianist to play so that way he has an idea of like a playlist. But I'm sure, you know, he'll play anything that we ask him as the night goes on. So I just texted everybody. So I can't wait to hear, you know, what songs that they choose. And uh, let me see. What else? Oh, Marsha. 
You and your friends go to the fireplace restaurant. Oh, your daughter lives in New Middletown. Oh my goodness, she lives so close. That's so, that is wild. Well, hi, Marsha. <laughs> um, maybe someday I'll meet you around town because you know me, I'm everywhere when it comes to pulling Borman Canfield. <laughs> and uh, you guys like the red lipstick that I wore yesterday, so thank you so much. Um, do Lorna and I exchange gifts for Christmas? You know, we don't. Um, like the one year we sort of did, but we both told each other. I mean, that's just, we don't, it's not to do it. You know, we'd rather, you know, we always say like put our money towards like our family and stuff like that. So, um, no, we don't. And um, someone else asked how, or Lauren and I related. No, we're not related. We're just great, great friends. We met through other friends and had so much in common with one another. And just to give you an example, you guys, that shirt that I bought yesterday at 850 Blues with the uh, faux fur, I said to Lauren, oh, I finally found something to wear for Christmas Eve. And she goes, well, what is it? And I explained, she goes, I swear I have that same shirt. I said, really? I said, nah. I said, let me take a picture of mine. I'll send it to you. She says, well, I'll take a picture of mine and I'll send it to you. It's the same shirt. The same shirt. I mean, isn't that funny? Like, we have so much the same taste. It, 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 that's, why we're, that's why we do what we do. Honest to God. We just laugh. This happens all the time. Um, do Vito and Archie get along? Kendra. Um... If Archie goes over there, Vito doesn't like Archie. But if Archie comes here, they get along. So it's like one of those, you know, territorial kind of things. And um, next Christmas, Beth Dixon is treating herself to advent calendars. Get easy ones to open. Let me tell you. <laughs> I've had a heck of a time with that QVC one. But I really the Body Shop one and my Scentsy one I love. But I'm definitely going to change those up, I think, for next year. Uh, oh, TRR81, does a yearly subscription to the Beach Towel Box carry over to next year? Absolutely. Uh, well, no, I take that back. If you subscribe for a year, once your year is up, it does not automatically renew for the next year. So if you want it, like those of you that sign up from the very beginning for the Beast Style Box for the yearly subscription, this is your last box. So if you want to continue to get them, you have to sign up after this box, after January's, for another yearly subscription. And I suggest to do that. So that way, you know, it's one of those things is FOMO, fear of missing out. That way you don't have to worry about, oh my gosh, I have to bit order this box. You'll know that you already are guaranteed one. Um, Jamie, you make pit cells too, and your dog loves them. Isn't that funny? Is it something in it? Is it the anise? I'm not sure what it is. But my mom, my mother-in-law makes Easter bread, and there's some anise in it. And Archie, when I make it, as soon as he hears that, like he smells it in the toaster, he comes running. He loves it. And my other dog, Breast is Bless, is called Breast of Soul, Max was the same way. Same exact way. Um, how far is Lakewood, Ohio from me? Um, Pam, Pam Lakewood is about an hour from us. Yeah, that's not far at all. Um, my band might be going there in November of 2020. Let me know, Pam, and let me know where, if that happens. We'd love to check it out. That would be so much fun. So please let us know. Uh, let's see what else. Uh, Pink for Marie wants to know, can you please tell me about your advent calendar one with daily gestures towards others? Well, there's the one that I read to you guys uh, was from Christopher Allen, who's a YouTuber. And the other one, um, basically, I just went on Pinterest a, like a month or probably two months ago and pulled up advent calendars, like kindness kind of things. And of all the ones that were out there, I just pulled the ones that I thought would be perfect for Lauren and I to do uh, for our families. You can find so many different types of those on Pinterest. And let's see. And this is from Susan Springall. What things are you kind of, what things are kind of down you, oh, pigment, aw. What will I do when Vlogmas is over? I don't know, you guys. So many of you guys said the same thing. Oh my gosh, my hand's falling asleep pulling this camera. So many of you guys said the same thing. You know, I enjoy so much speaking, you know, talking with you guys every day. I don't know. I'm going to feel the same way with some of the vlogmases that I watch as well. Um, oh my gosh, South Korea. Oh my goodness. Uh, Rosanna, 16, am I saying that right? I'm watching you all the way in South Korea. 
Why is it I can't spend Christmas with our daughter? Oh my goodness, I'm so glad you're watching me out there. Thank you so much. And Merry Christmas to you and your family. How cool is that? Gosh, so no, so neat. Um, love the pearl idea. Um, Cheryl Whedon, yes, thank you. Cheryl, hi Cheryl. <laughs> um, let's see what else. Karen, all the spread recipes in clear. It says two cans of black olives. What size cans? Guys, just the normal cans, like any kind of can you would buy, a can of corn, um, like can of green beans, those, those cans like this, you know, the normal like soup can size of olives. Um, yeah, that's what it is. Hold on, let's see. And I'm telling you, that dip is like the best ever. Um, okay, what else? How do you do um, buy the yearly subscription for the B-Style box? Um, you guys just go to www.bstyle, B-E-S-T-Y-L-E box.com and then click on their um, subscription, yearly subscription. And, oh my gosh, I know, I always look here and I see so many different comments, you know, throughout the day, and then I should, you know, in the beginning I was always writing them down. Concord, Ohio, hi Concord, Ohio, hi Cheryl. Cost Grove, hello, hello. Love the fireplace with the lights and ornaments. Is it one piece? Yes, the fireplace is. Oh, what the decor on my fireplace? Um, it's the gr there's greenery on there, you know. And then I added the lights to it. I added the uh, sprinkly kind of um, leaves, like the sparkly, sprinkly, sparkly leaves, and the bulbs. Everything on the actual piece that I bought, like a Hobby Lobby, I've added to it. Um, oh gosh, I'm sorry guys, my hand is literally falling asleep holding this camera up here. Okay, I have to, oh my gosh, I talked for 10 minutes. Oh lordy, okay, um, let me answer. Oh, where did, how did we meet um, Rose Young? Yes, we, you know, we met via friends and we do not live in the same neighborhood, but we live in the same town, so we live really close to one another. And, okay guys, um, do, 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 okay. Would I do another cleaning video, Sharon Amons? I'm not sure. I mean, do you guys really like seeing that? I'm gonna be honest with you. I mean, cleaning isn't my favorite thing to do in the world, so I don't know if I'd want to sit and watch someone else clean, but let me know. I mean, comment in the sec comment section if you guys want to see me do another clean with me video. All right, guys, I'm going to put this camera down. My hand is literally falling asleep and wait for Mark. He should be home any minute now and then uh, figure out what we're gonna do tonight. All right, guys, so we're gonna walk into Michael Alberini's have some appetizers and some drinks <laughs> it'll be fun place is packed i'm sure it's a lot of christmas like you know holiday parties and stuff going on right now but uh it's always a fun place food's always great here all right guys you want to do a Lamb lollipops, which are the absolute best here at Alberini. 